It's the much Trey Black. Today we're gonna react to Shadow Hedge Hogs, the Spotlight in Death Battle. Let's watch. Dr. Gerald Robotnik, grandfather to the Dr. Eggman we all know, had a problem. His granddaughter, Maria, was dying, succumbing to a neuroimmunity disease with no known cure. But old Jerry had a plan. When the government contacted him to build the ultimate life form, he figured its DNA could cure Maria no problem. So he took the job, and by studying the infinite power of Chaos Emeralds, with some alien assistance, he made the one and only Shadow the Hedgehog. Wait, did the government commission him, or was it Hot Topic? Better question, since when were hedgehogs ultimate disease-curing life forms? I mean, Gerald's prototype was a lizard, which sort of makes sense, as certain reptiles have regenerative tissue, but then he went from this to a hedgehog. Okay? Who cares if he's a lizard, hedgehog, squirrel, or whatever, Wiz? All that matters is he's super badass looking, super badass sounding, and is super powered by chaos. Literally, Shadow's powers are directly tied to those of the Miracle Gem's Chaos Emerald. He can tap into their power for incredible feats, similar to his Blue Blur rival. Likely for this very reason, he actually possesses many of the same abilities as Sonic. You know, the guy who's so fast he can almost outrun a black hole? Spin attacks, homing attacks, spin dashes, etc. But unlike his blue buddy, Shadow's not afraid to get serious and bust out some lead. Hey Sonic, why use a spin attack when you've got a goddamn gun or a sword as big as you? Look at that thing! He's used some of the same power-ups that Sonic's picked up, like heat barriers and magnetic lightning shields. But he also has some unique gear all of his own. His air shoes are way cooler than Sonic's sneakers. They can boost his speed to match Sonic's and also let him fly. Kind of. He's even got some gear attached that lets him attack at the speed of light. However, all of these abilities and equipment are mere accessories to Shadow's true power. The might of chaos itself. Even without an emerald on hand, Shadow can summon similar power, manifesting attacks like Black Tornado, Chaos Blast, or the deadly Chaos Spear. Hey, that reminds me of my power, Chaos Spear! Oh really? And what does that do, exactly? It's when I use my edgy chaos energy to spawn a full can of beer in my hand. It's never failed me. You mean when you open the fridge and you take one out? What? As I demonstrate, I push through the cold. I grasp the steely can, ripping it from its home so that I may consume it for pleasure. Anyway, come back in a couple days to hear about Shadow's opponent, Ryuko Matoi. If you like the video, give a thumbs up. I'll see you on my next reaction. This is the Montre Black. Peace.